Hi, today I prepared another population genetics video for you. And here is a problem. If you have a population of 100 elephant seals, 50 males and 50 females, dominated by single alpha male, where NC or number of uh, population census would be 100, what is the NE or effective population number? And before I will show you how to solve this problem, I want you to understand the difference between NC and NE. Uh, so NC stands just for the total number of animals and NE stands for the effective population size. And usually these numbers uh, never equal because uh, imagine that um, some society can have uh, uh, some animals that is too old for breeding and some of them can be too young or some of them can have different uh, health problems so uh, in effective population size we only count uh, those animals that do breeding and uh, here on this uh, picture you see uh, elephant seals here is the uh, two males and of course this male that is on the right here don't have much chance for breeding because this male on the left is uh, much larger and heavier and uh, we call such animal alpha male that do most of the breeding and uh, though this picture cruel but this is real life and uh, today I want uh, to show you not only one formula but I want to show you three formulas that we use to uh, in order to calculate uh, effective population size where uh, balance between uh, sexes matters so first formula would be uh, n e effective population size uh, would this formula we apply when we have just this balance between sexes for example we may have 70 males and 30 females but all of them participate in the breeding so here's a formula for n m and m here stands for the male multiplied by a uh, number of females and f here stands for the females and uh, divided by uh, total number of uh, males plus total number of females so once again we use this formula when we just have this balance between sexes and all of the animals participate in the breeding and here's a second formula where n e effective population size equal to mm, when we have balance between sexes for example uh, the number uh, equal so in this case we have n m plus n f and uh, in this case n e effective population size would equal to n c uh, number of animals census so this is a formula uh, here uh, represent a human society where usually we have balance between sexes and the last formula that we are going to apply today in order to solve this problem would be n e effective population size would equal to 4 multiplied by a uh, number of females divided by number of females plus 1 because a uh, number of males in such society would equal to 1 so we just uh, now can uh, uh, put uh, all the numbers that we have so 4 multiplied by uh, 50 females and divided by 50 females plus 1 male and the answer here would be 3.9 and what does this number mean so this is our answer today and this means that uh, actually effective uh, population size 
uh, would be uh, uh, only four. So that means that uh, uh, number those number of elephant seals in this uh, population is one hundred, but it equals only to four animals that po uh, that participate in breeding. So of course this has a lot of uh, implications for uh, inbreeding, for gene flow and uh, for restoration uh, and uh, conservation purposes and for breeding programs. So this is all for today. Thank you for attention. Please subscribe for my new videos that I post almost every day. Thumbs up if you like this video. See you next time. Goodbye.